Today I'm going to be reviewing this YNL shower curtain rod that I recently purchased on Amazon. This is what it's going to look like when it comes in the box from Amazon. So this is going to be a big long brown cardboard box. It does say on it, on it uh, what it actually is going to be. So I'm going to open it up, show you what it looks like, and then I'm going to put it onto our shower. Now there are a ton of different color options from YNL that you can choose from. I believe this was just the regular gold that we went with. This is going to be a tension curtain or shower rod. So to open it up, you're not actually going to just pull it out. You're going to actually unscrew it to make it longer. Or if you need to make it shorter, then you're just going to tighten it in. And you can see it's going to shorten up there on this end. And then it's not going to pull out anymore. It will push in. So it has like a spring. So it has a little bit of springiness to it. So you can adjust exactly what size you need for your shower. So let me go ahead and head in there and show you what that's going to look like. Now I just kind of put it up in front of the other shower rod that we had here, just so I can kind of show you a decent comparison. So this one here is one that we just purchased from like Walmart or Target. I can't remember where we got that one from, but this is one from YN, YNL right here. And you can see this is going to have a much bigger um, base to this than this one is. So that's going to be really nice in regards to distributing the weight, especially if you have a, a heavier shower curtain. I do love the way that it looks going all the way across as well. So that's going to be really nice. A really nice option now obviously you can adjust the tension on this so just by once you get it to the right length then you can just kind of spin that and it's going to make it a little bit longer and make it a little bit tighter if you do have something like this with your shower enclosure or shower stall where you can kind of put it on top then that's going to work out best in most cases as it'll keep it for sure from falling off even if your kids like accidentally grab onto it or something like that but this is going to be plenty of, of tension so you can see here i don't even have it on top of there and it's easily holding it up on both of the sides and I haven't even really tightened it down much so you can see I'm just gonna kind of spin that on that and I'm just gonna make it a little bit tighter so you can totally adjust that left or right or shorter or longer as needed so overall really really happy with the way that it looks I love the bigger um, base or bottoms whatever you want to call them on both ends of this tension shower curtain rod